Good morning guys. We are on our third order for the day. It's only been two hours and we've only gotten three orders. What a letdown, huh? You would think, but every single order has been a catering order and I am at $67. So not bad at all. And hopefully our day can keep going good like this. Like I said yesterday, I'm going to tell myself I will make my goal today. And we are already way over what we're supposed to be at this hour. So yeah, we're for sure gonna make our goal today. Hopefully we can make a little bit more because yesterday we didn't make our goal. It would be nice to recoup some of that money we weren't able to make yesterday. The second order I had, I got to the drop off and my car still started. I get out of the car, shut the front door, or shut the driver's side door, get out and I hear my car lock. And I locked the door. I locked my, the door with the catering order still in the car. I texted the customer and I said, sorry, I locked my keys in the car and I can call somebody to come unlock the car and it should be like 25 to 30 minutes and they didn't respond so I was like oh well I'll just wait and keep in mind it's freezing cold outside so I was freezing my buns off I was like you'll have to sorry there's it's just gonna take 20 minutes 20 to 30 minutes for them to get here and they came out they happened to have a car lockout kit in their truck so they were able to come help me get my keys unlocked from my car that was really nice and I didn't have to call a locksmith or have my wife come and help me get into the car. That was nice. I'm gonna keep filming and we'll see how this the rest of this day goes. We just finished our third catering order in a row. It was gonna pay me $16.50 for that order, but it paid me, um, sorry if you can see that, $36.85 for that order. And this is the same person that tipped me the $79 for that um, Chick-fil-A order. I don't usually ever deliver to the same people, but today I delivered to this building twice. That's awesome, I'm, I don't know, it's pretty cool. Pretty cool, I'm at 80 something dollars. Let me check real quick. $80 after three orders, that is like really good. 83.90 is what I'm at now, instead of the $63 that I was going to be at. So it was an extra $20 tip. So, like I say, you guys should join the wait list to get in the large order program. Like and subscribe if, if you like this video. It helps a lot and means a lot too. If you like this video or others like this, go check out more on my channel. At the end of this video, I'll be linking a video I think you'll like. Hope you guys will stick around, watch this, and watch my other content. That's about it for... For this order we will see what else we get for the day after locking my keys in my car I've been turning off my car every single time I do a drop-off because I'm scared that my door is going to lock itself again and I'm not gonna be able to have somebody to unlock the door if I'm you know too far from home or you know I have to wait like 30 minutes for somebody for a locksmith to come out that's what I've been doing right now. It is 11.30 and we are at $149. Today has been really good. We got the f first three orders of the day were um, all catering orders. So that really helped to put today off to a good start. Uh, right now we're dropping off this pizza order. It's about 20 minute drive. <clears throat> But we're going to get that dropped off and we are going to be at our goal for the day after that drop off. And then we have an hour and a half. I usually stay out till 1.30. So we have an hour and a half after that to make up for what we didn't make yesterday. So we're going to do that and yeah, see you guys then. Okay, so we are at $168.69. It is 12.35 so we're going to keep going. We're going to go for about an hour a little less than an hour and see if we can make up what we didn't make yesterday this video probably won't have many of the drop-offs in it but that's okay hopefully it's long enough for you guys and thanks for watching guys
Okay, so this camera battery is about to die, but we didn't end up getting any more orders after that. After I said I was gonna go out until for an hour or whatever, I just had some some things I needed to return at Kohl's, so I just went to Kohl's and did that. And I'm on my way home now. That's probably it for today's video. If you guys liked the video, give it a big thumbs up. If you have any questions or concerns or comments, leave them down in the comments down below. That's it for today's video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, and drive safe out there, guys.